Okay, so let's suppose you discovered a great blog, for example, Free Technology for Teachers, and you decide you want to keep track of when that blog is updated. You can use something called RSS. And how that works is, every time the blog is updated, if you've subscribed to the blog, you'll get a notification that the blog has been updated and you can read that blog entry. Now, the icon, so you can look on the page and find it, kind of looks like this icon I'm showing up here. All right? Or, possibly it looks like this orange icon up in the top corner in the, in the, brow, in the um, address there. Anyway, so those two things there are RSS icons. Maybe there's a link on the page that says subscribe. You click on that link or you copy the link address. So you copy the address of the link and you can actually subscribe right in Outlook. So we open up Outlook and you may notice right, right down here um, I have this thing called RSS feeds. It's a folder. I right click on the folder and I can add a new RSS feed. I, uh, I can paste the feed into that location. I uh, buy press control V on uh, Windows and then I click on add and then here I click on yes I trust this person and what's going to happen is it that, that uh, it's going to go and look to see if there's any new posts on that blog and what you can see is that it's gone and collected a whole bunch of entries from that blog so I can go through and I can read those entries as if they're email and you can do this with any blog that has an RSS icon if you discover that maybe this is too many posts, you don't want to read it, you can mark all of them as read. You can zoom through them and go, oh, I'm reading these things. Or if you're tired of reading a blog, you can come here and you can delete the folder. And that'll get rid of the blog completely. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask me.